Hello guys and welcome to this new video. Today I'm gonna show you how to make this kind of portraits. I got a request on a video on my TikTok to show you how to make this. So I'm gonna show you how to do it. The best part is everyone can make this. Even if you just start with drawing. Okay, the first step is to look for a good picture of the person you want to make. I got a request to make Buck from the series 911. You can choose every picture you want. The only thing you have to look for is that a lot of contrast and light and shadow. The more different shadows and lights, the better. Here is the picture of Buck. On the left is the picture printed. The right one is the picture online. That way I can see more darker tones. The second step is to draw the back of the drawing with charcoal. You can use a pencil or a charcoal stick. You have to do a good layer of it and smear it out with your hand so it is attached good to the paper. You can also draw the portrait yourself, but this works too. If you just start with drawing, this is a good solution to learn more about the proportions of the face. Now you put the picture with the charcoal behind on the paper you want to draw on. Place it the way you want and tape it so it doesn't move. Now you use a pen, that's important. You have to use a pen, a pencil wouldn't work. This step is important. You are gonna draw a lot of lines for the portrait. Not just the lines of the head, but also the different tones, from dark to light. This takes some time to understand, but eventually you see it. I always start with the form of the head and then the different darker and lighter tones. The best case is to just draw the extra lines and see if you're gonna use them. Now that's done, you have to get something like this. It depends on the picture of course. Now you can start with the black pens. You have to have different thicknesses of pens. I use these pens, but if you have a few, it's good too. You start with the, all the lines you just traced. To get the best result, use one of the thick pens. In the end it looks like this. Now erase the pencil lines with an eraser. Now we can start filling the spaces. First you start with the hair and the darkest parts to draw all black with a big pen or marker. Make sure that every line is towards the same points like I do. If you have that, it looks something like this. Always do the darkest line by the nose and the eyes to get the best result. Now you go to the thickest pen you have and do the next darkest color. Draw lines, but almost touching each other. It looks like this after. You do that with every part you drew, from dark to light. Every time you use a thinner pen or you put more space between the lines. You can watch how I do it. You have to make sure that if you fill a blank with a number 0.8 for example, the spaces next to it cannot be with the same pencil. So you have to make sure that you use the right ones. In the end it looks like this. If it's different, it's okay. It is never the same. I hope this tutorial helps you to make this kind of portraits too. 
If you have any questions, ask them in the comments and I will answer them. I hope you liked this video. Make sure to like and subscribe so I can make more of those tutorials. I hope I see you guys in the next video.